The benefits of Massimo's O3 regional oximetry on root patient monitoring and connectivity platform. The root patient monitoring and connectivity platform offers multiple high impact innovations for broad application across the continuum of care, including a high visibility display of Massimo's breakthrough rainbow and set measurements from the Radical 7 pulse co-oximeter an intuitive touchscreen navigation for easy and adaptable use in any hospital environment, and flexible measurement expansion through Massimo Open Connect, enabling connection with O3 regional oximetry and Z-line brain function monitoring. The O3 system is comprised of three components, root, the O3 Massimo Open Connect Mach 9 module, and O3 sensors. O3 regional oximetry helps monitor cerebral oxygenation in situations where pulse oximetry alone may not be fully indicative of the oxygen in the brain. O3 can be combined with Z-line brain function monitoring and advanced rainbow parameters on the same platform. Specifications for the O3 adult sensor include a trending regional oxygen saturation accuracy of 3% and an absolute regional oxygen saturation accuracy of 4%. Specifications for the O3 pediatric sensor include a trending regional oxygen saturation accuracy of 3% and an absolute regional oxygen saturation accuracy of 5%. In a study of 27 adult subjects published in anesthesia and analgesia, researchers found a trending regional oxygen saturation RSO2 accuracy of 2.1% absolute regional oxygen saturation RSO2 accuracy of 4% when using O3 on adult patients. O3 responds to changes in a patient's pCO2 concentration. A patient's CO2 concentration may change over the course of a case due to clinical interventions and physiological conditions. Changes in a patient's CO2 concentration may affect cerebral blood flow, thus impacting cerebral saturation values. In this clinical case, pCO2 was increased at approximately 120 minutes. As a result of the increase in pCO2, RSO2 increased from approximately 48% to above 70%. In this clinical case, pCO2 was increased at approximately 60 minutes. As a result of the increase in CO2, RSO2 increased from below 50% to above 65%. During the O3 validation study, the pCO2 levels of test subjects were not tightly controlled. The O3 window en route displays the RSO2 value, or the tissue oxygen saturation, the RSO2 trend, the baseline RSO2 marker, a numerical value and corresponding marker that indicates the value of the user's set baseline, area under the curve, an index of the duration and depth of a patient's cerebral saturation below the user-defined RSO2 low alarm limit. Delta base, the relative decrease in RSO2 with respect to baseline RSO2 expressed as a percentage. And delta SpO2, the difference between RSO2 and peripheral SpO2 when used with the radical 7 in root. Z-Line Brain Function Monitoring is also available as a Mach 9 module en route. The Z-Line system is comprised of four components, root, the Z-Line Mach 9 module, the Z-Line patient cable, and the Z-Line sensor. Z-Line helps clinicians monitor the state of the brain under anesthesia with bilateral data acquisition and processing of EEG signals. Z-Line uses four simultaneous EEG leads to enable continuous assessment of both sides of the brain. Z-Line and O3 seamlessly integrate into Root for simultaneous use on a single platform. When used together, brain function monitoring and cerebral oximetry may provide additional clinical insight, including increased visibility to the hemodynamic stability during anesthesia and insight into brain injury patients in the ICU.
The RD Sedline sensor allows for simultaneous application of Sedline and O3 sensors with soft foam pads to improve patient comfort. Kite provides a supplemental display of data from root, including O3 and Sedline data. Kite's supplemental display can be customized to feature the most applicable data for the current patient or case. The use of cerebral oximetry can provide the anesthesiologist with a more holistic picture of the overall status of the brain during anesthesia, complementing brain function monitoring to achieve better clinical outcomes.